Hello everybody, I'm going to show you a simple way that you can share your screen while you're using Google Meet and still see your students and at the same time see what you are sharing. So I'm going to start here in my classroom and what I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to open up my Google Meet link. Before I do that, I'm assuming right now that during my Meet I'm going to share my Google Classroom screen. I also want to share this um, set of rules for Google Meet with my students. You should make sure you prepare what you want to share in Windows um, and tabs before you start. And you're going to want to set this up before the meeting starts. This is exactly what I would do. So I would open up my link to Google Meet and now I'm not going to join for the moment. What I'm going to do as I also want you to make note of right now, my Chrome browser is in full screen mode. That's really important to make this work. You have to start with your Chrome browser in full screen mode. So now I'm going to take my Meet tab up here and I'm going to grab it with my cursor and I'm just going to pull it down and then I'm going to release it. That'll separate that tab from the other two tabs, but it's still in full screen mode. Now I'm going to go up onto my keyboard and I'm going to tap on the very top row, the fourth key over from the escape key, which is a little key that has three boxes on it. I'm going to click that and I get this view. What I'm now going to do is I'm going to take my cursor and I'm going to grab my Google Meet tab or window and I'm going to click and I'm going to pull it over into the other and you can see that they will marry together. You can see there's a line here. It doesn't, for the moment, as long as you can see that the two have squished together, you're good. Click on it and it brings it out. What I've done is I've put the two windows together. Now I'm going to drag the big thick black line over and I'm actually going to make my meat window bigger, about like this. So now you can see that I'm looking at my meat and I also have what I want to share over here. Now I'm going to join my meeting. So now I'm in my meeting. We can pretend that my students have now all joined. I'm going to go right here and click present now. I'm going to just say I want to present a window and I only want to present this window, which is the window that I'm already seeing over here. It will be a little squished for students, but it will still get the point across and you can adjust it to whatever, however you feel you would like it to be. So I'm going to click that. I'm going to say share. Okay, give it a moment. In case you didn't know, if you want to see what your students are seeing, just go up here to the right hand side beside your face and click and you'll see what the students are seeing. So now I know the students are seeing this. It's the same as what I have over on my left. I'm going to go back, of course, and click on my screen. And if there was students in here, you're going to see everyone over here. Then you can go over and you can manipul manipulate your other window um, any way you like. Okay, you can discuss. You can still see your students. You can show them different tabs. You may want to hit present mode. If you're showing a slide, you'll get a bigger version. But this is the simple way that you can see your students and see what you're presenting with your students while you're using Google Meet. Good luck out there, people.